What's going on everybody? It's Derek Fatal RPM. I just want to give a quick update of what's uh, been going on as of lately. Part of the reason why there haven't been many uploads recently is because of an event that happened with the Genesis a few months ago. So I'm going to break down exactly what happened. So one day I'm out driving around looking at cars, like going to several local dealerships, not like the big dealerships, but like uh, the places you see, usually see on the side of the road that have a few cars in the lot. Uh, just trying to see if anybody had any good deals or anything out there uh, for a Lyft slash Uber type situation. Uh, so I'm going around, day's coming to a close. I'm like, okay, I'm done looking at all my cars or all these cars. Let me head home, grab something to eat, yada, yada, yada. So it's around rush hour, so around 4 or 5 o'clock. Uh, I'm coming out of a... Uh, parking lot into essentially a four lane traveling road uh, but it had a total of five lanes so it had two outgoing two incoming and then a middle turning lane uh, so waiting my turn for uh, the traffic to stop so that I can actually proceed out into the street um, and traffic comes to a standstill and they actually made a gap for me to come through uh, so it's cool so I inch forward, um, and there aren't any cars coming, so I go to get in the turning lane. As soon as I get halfway into a turning lane, I see this car speeding down the turning lane. Mind you, we're nowhere near an intersection, so, and there's nowhere for them to turn. Uh, so there's, they were just obviously traveling in the speeding lane. So basically, this is how it happened in my head. I was like, okay, if I stop, I'm getting hit. If I keep going, have a chance of actually getting out of the way. Uh, because this was like two cars away from me when I noticed that there was a car, I'd have to say going at least 30 miles an hour, uh, in the turning lane. So I'm like, need to react quickly. So I try and go. So put my foot on the gas to get out of the way. Uh, that didn't work. Uh, so my rear tire gets hit, sends the car spinning, and into another car I was actually right behind the guy in the turning lane through my head it's just going I'm like damn it damn it damn it why why of all times for something to happen to this car is it happening like now like after all the Vegas stuff and um, after the Atlanta trip I'm like I'm actually kinda happy that when it happened it happened if it had to happen that it happened when it happened uh, if that makes any sense um, basically what I mean is I'm glad that it happened after got all the work done that I was trying to do at that time on the car uh, done was able to make it all the way down to Atlanta and back uh, safely which was actually a huge endeavor uh, first time actually taking a road trip of that caliber with that car which is actually really nice I'm not going to explain everything after the accident like what happened when we were there because frankly it's not worth going over so Essentially, what happened to the car is it had front-end damage um, and a little bit of rear damage from where I got hit. Uh, the front, the, bash, the crash bar was destroyed, bumper destroyed, hood was crinkled. Uh, the engine looked to be okay. It looked like the radiator support was obstructing the uh, belts, which was basically keeping the car from turning over. Um, but my insurance company, uh, didn't really even look into it. Honestly, they just kind of looked at the car and was like, Hey, it's total. So they totaled it out. Um, uh, so unfortunately the Genesis is gone. Uh, now essentially what's been happening between then is, uh, getting a new car, getting everything together, figuring out what I want to do with the car and where I'm going to take the channel from here. Um, the good news is that. I'm I'm not done. So we're going to continue on with the new car. The only downside is is for everybody who's been actually following from here, uh, have been seem seem like I'm not sure if any of you actually own. I know like four or five of you do, uh, but whoever does own a Genesis, that there will not be any more uh, Genesis content being posted on the channel. Uh, but it's still, all going to be car related. Uh, I'm going to do some gaming videos and stuff, uh, just to get some, 
get some content out there for you guys if you're at all interested in that uh, as well as some uh, tech videos but I digress this is not going to be like a main video it's just kind of something I want to give you guys an update on since I'm finally in the position where I'm going to somewhat start doing stuff it is getting cold now so I'm not going to really be able to do much during the winter seeing as how I don't have a garage and I mainly do everything on the street uh, so we'll figure it out from there uh, I did get a new car uh, I'm going to be doing the reveal on that uh, next week so what I'm basically going to be doing is structuring uh, the channel I'm going to have an upload like every week or every other week depending on how I can get the videos I don't just want to be shooting out random videos uh, because I kind of defeats the purpose of having an audience because uh, well, if I'm trying to build my audience I don't want to just throw shit in a wall and see what sticks uh, so just just want to thank you guys for watching uh, if you have a comment want to tell me something down below just let me know leave a like to show the support on the video and don't forget to subscribe and click the little bell icon to get a notification for when I upload a video that's going to be it for now thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one Shit.